Yo, good morning guys. Uh, it's another early morning. It is 7.44 and I'm about to head off to work. But thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you're a newcomer, I ask that you guys uh, please stay tuned and uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks so much for tuning in. Squash it. It's your mind. Hello everybody, I just got off of work and I'm really happy that I'm off of work and tomorrow I only have like a four hour shift and it's on Halloween. They took off my double shift, so I'm super happy about that. Because I was like, managers, why? Why'd you do me this way? Because I was like the only one on the schedule who had a double shift and I was like, this is kind of jacked up. And I checked, my morning shift was only like an hour and 25 uh, minutes long and I thought that was like really kind of dumb. But, you know, that's like only making a $9. But still, I mean, yeah. I'm not big on like, oh, I need money, so I need to work as little, as all I can, so as all I can. See? I think when I sit in a car, like, my grammar just goes out the window. But, yeah, um, um, I'm off work, and um, crazy experiences today, guys. Two crazy experiences. It was my first time ordering at Starbucks, but I didn't get a Starbucks, so... I was ordering, I had to order like four different things for some of the workers and it went pretty bad. It went fairly good considering that I, it was my first time ordering there because I, I don't know. The lady was like, what would you like? And then I, I was like, yeah, let me get a large whatever I said because I can't remember. They have like some weird names. And she's like, you mean Venti? Bruh. That is the dumbest, or I don't know, Venti Grande, whatever the heck they're called. That stuff is so weird. I'm not a big fan of that. Like, I drink black coffee, so it doesn't even faze me to go to try to go to um, Starbucks. But, yeah, I did that today. And then an also crazy thing. All right, crazy story, guys. Um, at work, all right. I was frying, I was making chips, so it's on the fryer, right? And then I just got finished making chips. And my manager's like, hey, keep the keep the fryer on because she makes her breakfast in there. Loki, don't tell anybody that we make our own breakfast. We make pancakes and stuff like that at Chipotle. But we don't serve them. We make them for ourselves. So she started making her breakfast in the um, fryer, right? Okay, she shuts the fryer. But, all right, let me not even tell that part. But she shuts the fryer. Uh, time goes on, time goes on. Uh, we have a fax. Um, we have a line for fax and we have a regular line that customers come in and go to so on the fax line They put their bags They pre-make the bags and then the bags sit on the fryer, right? so um, The person who's working fax which is named TOS um, She put her bags all of her bags. She was making on the fryer, right? And then out of nowhere We go I turn around because I hear someone so say oh my gosh and then I turn around, I'm like, what is he talking about? And then I look over at the fryer, I see some like, I see the bag start to burn. And then I'm like, what is going on? And then I look and then like our restaurant tour, he's like the head of our store, top notch. He sees it and then he just like kind of starts laughing and I was like, what the heck, he's just laughing at this? But it was kind of funny, it was crazy because it was started out as a little fire. And then I don't know where that thing just blew up. Like it was a huge fire in the kitchen. And everyone was just like, all the customers are just like looking around and I was just like, screw it. I kept like doing my thing, you know, like chicken, steak, barbacoa, carnitas, whatever, butter, brown rice, black peanut beans, uh, chicken, steak, barbacoa, all that. But yeah, um, it was pretty crazy. It was pretty awesome at the same time. It was a cool experience. I've never seen like a huge fire like that in built and inside of a building. I thought we were all going to like go home cause the storm was going to burn down. But, uh, sadly we didn't get to go home, but <laughs> Just kidding, but yeah, good thing no one got hurt and everything like that, but it was pretty crazy. Um, Chipotle was definitely on fire today. Literally. But yeah, I'm going to head home, see what Chan and Nate are up to. Maybe Nate's home, I'm not sure. I know Chan is because he doesn't work today. But yeah, I'm ready for tomorrow because it's Halloween. Are you guys ready for Halloween? I'm so ready for Halloween. Tell a bit. Tell a bit. If you, don't, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about when I say that, who are you? <laughs> I'm just kidding, but yeah, I'm gonna head home. See you guys when I get there. Yo, what up, guys? I've been at home for about uh, two or three hours now. I've been editing uh, yesterday's vlog, so it'll be up shortly. Um, I'm just doing a little review on it. I'm chilling here with Chan, 
and we're watching Bill and Ted and just made me a cup of coffee and I'm actually about to go to Wendy's to get a frosty and but yeah I'm just finishing up editing right now and pretty much doing nothing just chilling before when till night gets home and uh, when Jerry hits us up and stuff to chill later and everything like that because it's the night before Halloween Taliban <laughs> so I'll hit you guys up when I get around and stuff hey. Yo, what's going on guys? Um, I'm uploading that video for or yesterday's vlog. It's uploading right now, and it should be done in about an hour or so. So, if you guys haven't checked that out already, I said you go peep that. And right now, we're literally about to go after Jerry gets here. We're going to go to Wendy's. I'm going to get a Frosty, because one of our coworkers from Chipotle works at Wendy's, so I, wanted, I told her I was going to go um, buy a Frosty from there. So, last time I let her down, so I'm going to do that today. And I'm ready for this frosty and probably get some like to eat too as well. <laughs> What's up guys? Just got the Wendy's. Like, share, and subscribe. <clears throat> Follow me on Instagram at uh, Gunther the Great, aka Dreadlocks. Dreadlocks for thoughts. Underscore. I might take your girl. You heard it here first. And last. That's the last time I'm saying mm -hmm. We're at Wendy's. Wendy's nuts. <laughs> Bowie. <laughs> Bowie. I got a flurry. Chant. <laughs> Hold on. Wendy's Frosty? Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a Frosty, guys. Cham's got a Frosty, too. Jerry, he got a... What's up? <laughs> <laughs> he got a little burger. Yeah, I know. It's done, though. I it's got done. me some tomato on that mustard, boy. Woo! Ended. <laughs> Yo, what's going on, everybody? I'm kind of slacking. I'm so sorry for that. But I didn't have an upload uh, either yesterday or the, uh, today. Or, I don't know. But I missed an upload, and... Sorry, players mess up, you know how it goes. But, yeah, today is actually the day after, no, no, two days after the last clip, which is, yeah, please accept my apologies, fellas and women. But I just want to let you guys know, dang, hold up, it ain't Halloween no more, I can't be this. I want to show you guys what I picked up at the mall today because it was on discount, and it's kind of crazy for me because I never get this. And it's something that I've been wanting for a while, even though I don't really wear it. And it's not the color I exactly wanted, but it was on discount, so I wanted to get them. And I put them on, and they feel really comfortable, so I got them. And I will show you guys what I got, because I'm done talking about it. Check it out. Let's sit down. All right, you guys ready? Three, two, boom. Whoa, Nikes. This is my first pair of Nikes in probably a year. Or maybe, yeah, probably a year or so. Um... I always wear Adidas, as you guys know, but hey, I'm switching it up, you know, but, and then, as I said to myself, I said this to myself when I, after, right after I got them, I was like, dang, now I'm about to get, like, Nike stuff to match, because I already know people are going to be like, dude, you're wearing Nikes with some Adidas sweats? Come on, bro, that's not even cool. Like, I really don't care. I'll honestly just wear these with Adidas sweats if I have to, if I want to. I mean, it's not a big deal. It's just clothes. It's like... I'll wear what's comfortable, is, even if it is different brands. It's like y'all are wearing, y'all wearing some Wranglers with the Dicky shirt. It doesn't matter. Y'all wearing some DCs with some uh, crew denim. It doesn't matter, man. It's the same with workout gear. But hey, I'll show you what kind of shoes I got. They are, bump da da, Scooby Doo. Where are you? Oh snap! These are clean, and they were on discount. Check this out. This is what I seen when I bought them. I seen that. And then they rung it up. And this has happened to me twice. It's, all right, it said $64.98. And I was like, screw it, dude. That's way cheaper than what they go for. And then she rung it up. And it only came out to 49 like 49 something. So it was right under 50 bucks. So I'm like, dang, it's like 75% off. These usually go for like 120 maybe. Oh, no, they go for 130 139 That is crazy expensive for these. And I got them for uh, 50 bucks. They're beautiful shoes. I love them. I'll be wearing them at the gym. I won't be like wearing them outside too much because they're white on white. 
but yeah I really like them they're comfy too and they got like the green insole pretty cool I just love these because I've seen someone have them but they're the black ones with the black and white uh, sole down here and I really liked those and they didn't I don't think they have them anymore or they don't have them they don't have them at the finish line or any I've never seen them at the mall that we have so I got these because they're on discount of course and I don't know I I got them try them on and put them on everything this is my first like actually fly knits uh, Nikes the Nike freeze or whatever they're called I don't know I don't even know Nike lingo this is crazy but I really love these shoes guys and I'm like I put them on and I was like dang I'm gonna start getting more Nike stuff so I'll be bouncing back around from like Nike and Adidas but besides the point after those shoes and everything I'm concluding this vlog since it has been stretched out uh, kinda wide um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video sorry for the wait and everything like that but I will be uploading quicker oh and a little um, announcement to make um, actually I will make an announcement on a separate video sorry about that but yeah I'm concluding this vlog guys so you guys please subscribe and like all that uh, tell your friends tell your dog tell your cat tell your mom and tell your girlfriend that I might steal her um, no, I'm just kidding Totally kidding, don't get mad. Don't get mad, but why are you mad? That's what I'm trying to figure out. But yo, uh, thank you for watching. Peace.